So this is a storm I'm with. It's got it's got some structure to it. You can see over here the upward motion and you can see over here the mass clouds the downward motion. You can see that right there. Now that's slightly concerning, but it's actually way back there. You can't even see it yet. That's gonna be where it's all at. I mean that that's probably got a tornado in it. Uh, big hail, very big hail. Maybe up to two inches in diameter and winds up to one hundred miles an hour. So it's it's a beast. Not one to take lightly, but I'm loving this right now. I'm going to be out here as long as I can safe. It's can great. you tilt the camera upwards? No, like sorry. No, just up in, up in the sky. No, the other way. Okay. Yeah, I, now just go up into the sky. I'm just looking at the cloud. Just a little bit higher. Uh-huh. Yeah, just there. Oh, look at that. That just above the rooftop there. Yeah. Now, you're saying, uh, where's the main area of interest? To your right? Uh, it's right there. Right there. Yeah, you can see the little cone shape there. That's what I'm. And how far would that be from your location? Uh, maybe two football fields or 200 yards away from me. Now, those trees are moving, have... or swaying. Yep. Wind hasn't picked up so much here just yet, but uh, it's it's going to, and you can see the lightning with it, too. This thing is... This thing is no joke. It's probably got two inch hail, one hundred mile an hour winds. I mean, it's 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 a big one. Weather service only has it at seventy, but velocities indicate it's much stronger than that. So, and it could have a tornado in it too. I'm looking at it. I tell you, the grass is very green. So you've had lots and lots of rain. I uh, just got a new yep. severe thunderstorm warning for my location. Uh, 70 mile per hour wind gusts, one and a half inch hail, and a possible tornado. So I am watching that very closely. Very closely. Jeez, Lou. We, oh, it's getting, it's getting strong out here. All the bugs are starting to freak out. Yeah, this thing is, this thing is no joke. You're recording this, Nathan? Yeah, this thing is absolutely no joke. Uh, it's it's headed right for me. I'm in the highest risk of severe weather today. I'm actually right in the bullseye for it. Like, within 20 miles of my house is the bullseye. So, this is it. This is probably going to be the biggest line I've seen in years. You can see the lightning and everything. I'm not sure how safe it is for me to be out here right now. The funnel there has pretty much diminished. What what was their velocities were indicative that that was some rotation. It still is some rotation. You can see the mammatus clouds over here, which means downdraft, updraft, storm. So it's probably, the, the rotation is probably way in there. It's probably much farther in than what I can see. But as soon as this curtain of clouds you see here passes me, it's going to get really bad really fast. So as soon as that passes, I got to get inside, and I may even have to tell everyone. I'm holding the party right now. My house is now it's uh, coming. To the it's coming towards you, isn't it? Yes, right towards me. From uh, what direction? This is going north to south, so I'm currently north facing due north. This is due north and this is headed right for me. And the, the warning area is population how many? Uh, I think it's well over 100,000. I know it includes the city, I live in, city of St. Charles, which is at least 100,000 there. St. Louis has at least 3 million there in it. So yeah, probably about 3.5 million, I'd say. Now look at all the lightning. The lightning has just gotten much bigger. 
which means this is this is really starting to ramp up here. This this wave of clouds is about to move past me, and as soon as it does, I have to go. Winds are really starting to pick up. Uh, Winds any, are really uh, starting to pick up. So it's it's about to get really bad really fast. As soon as this boundary layer of clouds passes me, I gotta run. This thing is uh, crazy. Yeah, this thing's about to go. So this thing's strengthening rapidly. The mammatus clouds are getting lower. The updraft is getting stronger, and as soon as this little boundary layer here passes, I gotta run. I gotta run. Yep, severe thunderstorm warning for us. One and a half inch hail, 70 mile an hour winds, and a possible tornado. So, as soon as, as, soon as this boundary passes me, I gotta get inside. You can see the lightning strikes there. This thing's powerful. Jeez Louise. Yeah, this thing. Yeah, that was a big boom. That was a big one. These things are going to gradually get bigger as this thing strengthens. If this thing really just goes nuts all of a sudden, that means it's outflow dominant. Uh, if the lightning really goes nuts, which therefore means that the uh, the storm is not going to be as capable of producing tornadoes anymore. Because it's rotating. We're, we're starting to get into the circulation of rotation. Yeah, it's it's coming in, Grandpa. You might want to get inside here soon. Because <laughs> as soon as this boundary of clouds you see here passes us, it's going to start pouring. Yeah, that boundary right there, it's within... It's within half a mile of us. No, but it trust me, it's there. Yes. Yeah, when it's uh it it could speed up all of a sudden too. This thing. Oh, that boundary's becoming better defined. Yeah, the winds are headed towards the storm, which means we're in the inflow. We're in the flow where this thing gets its energy, which means this is going to, the winds are going to pick up really fast as the inflow gets closer. Yep, headed due south. So, yeah, this thing is, uh, this thing is about to get gnarly. You can see it almost looks like stacked plates up here. Uh, this thing is about the width of, uh, St. Charles and, uh, Jefferson County. If you can take those two and put them in width, it's about how wide. Uh, so we, like all the way over there, way over here, I think the, it is. The more impressive stuff's actually over here. I can't see it. Yeah, that's where the more impressive stuff is. I'm actually going to try and get a better shot of that. If I can. From my front yard. There's a shot. Look at that. Look at that thing. Oh, that's... Yeah. There's the... There's the cell. There's the super. There's the super part of what makes a super cell a super cell. I'm in the low precipitation part right now. As soon as that boundary that I saw over there passes, uh, well, to say the least, I'm I'm gonna be in some trouble if I don't go in. So I'm gonna keep this going as long as I can, but I'm not sure how long I can keep it going. Oh, I like the lightning there, just to the right, yeah, just quite above the that. Region. Yep. Yeah, there we go. This thing's this thing's got some spectacular light. I got my OBS Spe recording too, Nathan. So you, you know, both of us, but spectacular light. Can you just pan to the left a little bit? Uh, let's see the light. Classic. Oh, look at that! And oh, oh, I just got the best strike of the evening. Look at that. Look at that. 
Wow. All right, this this thing is uh this thing's about to get crazy. Look at that. That's huge updraft. Whoa! <laughs> Look at that. That's incredible. Oh, okay. Here we go. This is it, man. Oh, oh my goodness. Things are getting crazy. Purple lightning and L. Can you guys hear me? Okay. Just want to make sure that my signal didn't cut out again. Wow. So, Nathan, what are you feeling about this? Interesting. 